everyone, David back with Awesome Autographs and More, episode number 137. And today we're going to do bargain box uh, pickups from the National. This is baseball part two of four. Uh, pick up where we left off last episode. We have Mr. Chad Durbin, rookie in the Red Sox organization that didn't go very far. <laughs> but anyways, got that card, got another version of it, another copy of it, I guess, same card. And Here's a copy, which is a jersey relic, and in the R there is where the jersey is uh, inserted. It's kind of a nice card. And next up, we have a few, couple of cards signed by Duffy Dyer. Two. Two Tigers cards and one Pirates card. Next up, we have Mr. Adam Eaton. It's actually a very nice card. I didn't notice it when I bought it, but there's actually a crease. It goes right across where the autograph is, but not very noticeable unless you really look for it. So that's Mr. Adam Eaton. Next up, Mr. Vaughn Eshelman, another Red Sox prospect. I think he pitched for the Red Sox for a couple of years, if I remember correctly. Uh, but again, not did not have a very long major league career. <laughs> Next up, Mr. Sean Estes. And then we have Mr. Robert Fick. And a couple of other Red Sox uh, prospects, Mr. Gar Binvold. Card number one and 93 Flair. The autograph is in there. It's just tough to see on this card. And then from there, we move to Mr. Dave Fleming. And another Dave Fleming. We have Kyle Davies. A little bit of reflectivity there. There's the autograph. Mr. Carlos Garcia. Okay, yeah, that's our first pile. Put those up on the stand. Hopefully they stay. And next up we have, I think it's four, yep, four cards of Mr. Kiko Garcia. One signed in ballpoint. And number four. Next up, we have a few cards of Mr. Rich Gedman. There's one. Two. Three 
and four. Uh, next up is, I think it looks like five cards of Mr. Jim Gott. <clears throat> One, two, Next up, one card of Mr. Brian Greback. And yes, he is the brother of former White Sox infielder Craig Greback. I don't think Brian made it much to the majors, as far as I know. Um, haven't done a lot of checking on his uh, career, but I haven't seen anything so far. And the end of the second pile, we have four cards of Mr. Mark Gubiza. One, two, three, and four. File number two, complete. And there were no GTMs today. The mailbox was empty. So now, on to pile number three. First, we have a couple of cards. Mr. Glenn Hoffman, brother of Trevor. Older brother, I believe older anyway. point autograph on there and then we have a Rick Honeycutt Tam House card number one and card number two Signed right across his chin. <laughs> and then we move on to a few cards from Mr. Glenn Hubbard. And next up is Mr. Rex Hudler. And then we have Jeff Fusen. And I know I'm going to butcher his name next, which is Mr. Adam. He's due. And then we have Ricky Jordan. Mr. Ron Kittle. Mr. Mickey Klutz. And then a couple of cards of Mr. Dave LaRoche. Also signed right across his face. And I have two manager cards, two of the same. Very hard to see the autographs, but they are on there. Oh, there, there's a pretty good view. Blue pen across the black jacket. 
it is what it is. They were cool. I thought they were pretty cool cards. Anyways, that's it for part number two of the bar bargain box finds at the National for baseball. Uh, just a reminder, episode number 134 has my August giveaway. If anybody hasn't seen that and wants to get into the giveaway, you can uh, watch episode number 134 and it explains what you need to do. In the meantime, thanks for watching. Thank the athletes for signing these cards at some point in time. And we will see you next time. Have a great day.